Hi, I'm Val Hart, the real Dr. Doolittle, and I'm here to help you have better behaved, healthier, happier animals for greater peace of mind, joy, and harmony. I'm an expert animal communicator, a master healer, a behaviorist, author, and an inspirational speaker. And I've been helping animal lovers the world over solve their most difficult animal problems for over 20 years. Your animal tries to tell you important things every day. And if you don't know how to speak their language and you don't take the time to communicate with them, you miss what they're trying to tell you and you can get into really serious trouble. You can waste a ton of energy, time, and money. And you can even wind up costing your animal their life. Whether you're struggling with behavior problems, training issues, performance and competition challenges, having health, pain, or other illness or diseases, or you're struggling with a euthanasia decision. Your job is to listen to your animal so they can tell you what's wrong and you can take appropriate action on their behalf. Tracy's dressage horse Aries was easily spooked, uncooperative, and dangerous. He also suffered from a mystery lameness problem that had the vets stumped. She was on the verge of giving him up when she contacted me for help. Aries told us what was wrong, where he hurt, and what confused him. And now they're excited to see each other and are winning almost every show they enter. They're both healthier and much happier. Laura's cat Molly was terribly ill after dental surgery. She was at death's door. She told me her head hurt, her mouth hurt. She felt like she'd been run over. She told us that the experience had been traumatic and frightening, and as soon as Molly was able to express herself, she began healing. She came out from under the bed, she stopped hiding in the closet, and she started eating and playing again. She went on to make a full recovery. Darla came home from work one day to find her dog Bailey vomiting. He had diarrhea, was shaky and weak, and was having trouble walking. She quickly racked up a $5,000 vet bill, but she still had no answers and a very sick dog. Bailey told me that the new floor cleaner was making him feel bad. Ha! Ah, mystery solved. He went on to make a rapid recovery. Well-intentioned animal owners make mistakes with their animals all the time without knowing it. And it's not really their fault. They simply don't know what to do differently. The biggest mistake you can make when you're having a problem with your animal's health, behavior, training, or performance is not taking the time to talk with them first to find out what the real problem actually is from their viewpoint. So once you know what they're thinking, you can go about resolving things by focusing on what's actually needed. So no more expensive guesswork. I would love for you and your animal to be my next success story. Don't just live with problems. Contact me. I can help. Go to my website now at www.valhart.com or email me at contactval at valhart.com. While you're on my website, be sure and get your free subscription to my Animal Talk Tips as well as a copy of my free report, The 10 Things You Need to Know Before Hiring an Animal Communicator. So don't wait. Get started improving your relationship with your animal right now.